Why did the Hebrew authors of the Bible omit all of the important historical names of Egyptian pharaohs? Why did they mix up historical fact with myths and legends? The big question is, what did they have to hide? Since vowels were interchangeable in the biblical Hebrew language, Amun can be spelled A-M-E-N, A-M-O-N, O-M-O-N, or A-M-U-N. Today, Amun is one of the most popularly used words in the entire world. It is used in all languages by Christians, Muslims, Hindus, and Jews at the end of prayer. Without realizing it, people all over the world are praising Amun. The Old Testament of the Bible is the holy book of both Christians and Jews. Amun is repeated over and over again throughout the Bible and is hidden within the word testament. The word Amun literally means the hidden one. Many are fooled into believing that Amun means so be it or truly. But in Kings 1 verse 36 of the Old Testament, Amun is identified as the Lord God of my Lord. Why in the world would the Vatican, a fortress of Puritan Christian values, erect a monument symbolizing the pagan god Amun and sexual intercourse right in its own front yard?